for him. <laughs> Much There's not long to go here, and uh, it looks like Liam Quinlan's going to try and make every post a winning one. Walking into the tape then, or in Mount Frisco's case, half trotting in. Hopefully we get a first-timer. Away they go. Over two miles the Grange, Nova's handicap chase. Taking each other on the early stages, it was Faith, Mount Frisco, followed by Chain of Consequence. The leaders are not hanging around. Mount Frisco wins the early exchanges to open up a lead over it was Faith and Chain of Consequence. A long way cleared of Don Daniel and then Juno and Victor Smashon next on the outside of Cosmic Rock. Onto the ditch, which is fence number three. Mount Frisco up and over from it was faced, chain of consequence had to reach. All cleared of Dun Daniel, Juno, Cosmic Rock, and Victor Smashon as they make the run out of the back straight. Mount Frisco with a reduced advantage of a couple of lengths over it was faced and chain of consequence. The three with a commanding advantage over the fourth and Daniel. And Juno, Cosmic Rock, and Victor Smashon. And then Dutch Schultz. At the back, McAlpine, McCharney. Long intervals between first and last as they turn in for the next two fences. Mount Frisco setting things up from it was face and chain of consequence. Juno moves to dispute the fourth with Dun Daniel, then Cosmic Rock. Invictus Mashon, followed by Stemmy Companion Dutch Schultz, and then McAlpine and McCharney. On to the first of the two fences in the straight. This fence coming up to fourth. It's Mount Frisco and Liam Quinlan by two lengths to it was Faith. Michael Connor in third, another two lengths back. And Mount Frisco took that fence by chance, a mistake, and gone. Invictus Mashon. Over five. Fence that'll be the last one next time. Up okay with. Sean Flanagan and Victor Smashon. Finishing next time, another six fences left to jump. And as Mount Frisco, it was fate still one and two. And third, this chain of consequence, then Don Daniel, Juno alongside. As they go to the next fence, a gap to Cosmic Rock. After Cosmic Rock is Dutch Schultz, McAlpine and McCharney remains the back marker. Going to the fence at the point at which they started. Six out. Mount Frisco extends the lead. Over it was. Fate chain of consequence. Then Don Daniel. Juno next. Then Cosmic Rock. Doug Schultz. McAlpine and McCharney. Across the back straight they go. To the first of three. Another five left to jump. And the Grange Nova's handicap chase. Mount Frisco. Over that from it was Fate who caught it. But survived. In third is Chain of Consequence, a mistake down the line by Dutch Schultz. Going to the middle fence of the back straight, four from the finish, Mount Frisco. Chased still by, it was Faith and Chain of Consequence, a little bit closer in fourth and fifth respectively. Then Daniel and Juno and then Cosmic Rock, who jumped off to the left. And then Mick Charlie, who's overtaken two at the back, McAlpine and Dutch Schultz. The ditch, the far end of the back straight, three from home. And it's Mount Frisco from it was Faith back within a length. Chain of consequence hit that hard. And then Dun Daniel. After Dun Daniel is Juno as they make the run to the final half mile with two fences left to jump and they swing in. Mount Frisco rejoined by It Was Faith. These two have been occupying the first two positions from flag fall. Moving into remote third is Dun Daniel. As they come down the hill for the swing in. Two left to jump. Mount Frisco and it was Faith. They're stride for stride. A long way cleared of Dun Daniel and then Juno. Round the bend for the final two fences. It was Faith. On the outside, it's just the leader on the turn from Mount Frisco. Continuing a long way cleared of Dun Daniel, Juno. Mick Charlie is next and then Cosmic Rock. Not many have got into this as they pass the two. Two fences left to jump and it is was Faith who regains the lead from Mount Frisco. Dun Daniel back in third. Then Juno, Cosmic Rock and Mick Charlie. Coming on to the second last, it was Faith from Mount Frisco, Don Daniel, 
is bridging the gap on the pair and Mount Frisco hit that hard it was faith these two are pretty leg weary with Don Daniel gaining them on the outside as they come to the final fence it was faith from Mount Frisco and here's Don Daniel at the last and Don Daniel plows through it Mount Frisco they're out on their feet it was faith coming home Juno and Mick Charlie it's a bunch up and from out of the clouds Dutch Schultz and Mick Charlie from last to first let's run them all down from Dutch Schultz and Juno and then Mount Frisco Don Daniel and it was fate. Well, what a race that was. A massive turnaround in the home straight with Mick Charlie getting up to win under Kevin Sexton. There he is. Don Daniel looked like he was coming to win. An awful mistake at the last, and then he, well, he was brought to a standstill, wasn't he? And uh, thereafter, he wasn't involved, and this fella got going late and got up in the closing stages. One imagine that was a carnage in running, you would have thought that. They were very, very tired in the closing stages, and he's got up to win. He traded as big as 930 to 1 on the exchanges in running. Right. I'll have to take